morning, everybody. Your friendly neighborhood, James Blackburn, here again. Today's date is February 1st, 2014. Talking with my hands. A uh, little bit of a happy and a sad day at the same time because we are uh, wrapping on Abe Makes a Movie today after uh, four weeks of awesomeness on this film with a great cast and crew and a bunch of awesome professionals. It's the last day. So today we're shooting at this abandoned church, which is for sale, and uh, should be interesting. I'm really uh, excited to be part of it and to be here. And uh, we're going to shoot here till about 3 or 4 in the afternoon, and then we're going to change locations to the Wool Warehouse, which if you've been watching the series of videos you'll see from a few days ago or last week, we were there for a few days as well. So that was kind of neat. Uh, we're going to go there and shoot the final scene of the movie, where rumor has it, but don't hold me to it, that my homeless character from the movie earlier in the film is going to show up at the end of the movie. Uh, but like I said, I, I'm not 100% sure if that's going to happen yet, but it's looking like it might. So stay tuned, because today is going to be an interesting episode. And I, real quickly here too, I want to talk about my new camera. Now, if you look, this camera on my left, that's my old camera. This camera on my right, that's my new camera. So I wanted to shoot two shots side by side so you can see them on the screen to see old, new, old, new, old, new. So I'm excited about that, about uh, having this new technology. Love my old camera. Going to use it as much as I can, still as well as a backup, but the new camera is also pretty cool. So stay tuned, guys, and uh, it'll be a fun episode. Okay, good howdy everybody. I'm back here at the church again, the abandoned church which is for sale. You can see it behind me there. And I'm rolling two cameras side by side so that you guys can see the two cameras back to back, what they look like. The This is the before camera, the one that's getting retired. This is the after camera, the brand new one. So we're here at this site again shooting and uh, it should be fun. Eventually we're gonna just go all new camera, but uh, for now we got both of them going, so check it out. This is my old camera, my Sanyo that I've had for years. It works really, really great. And as you can see, this is the new camera that we're using to shoot the new behind the scenes stuff. So it uh, should be interesting. So there you go. That's what the before camera looks like and the after camera. Yeah. Okay, on the camera left is the old camera. Camera right's the new camera. Uh, definitely notice a tone difference. They look a lot better. So there we go. More video updates here inside the old abandoned church. Got some cast members showing up now. Two cameras still rolling. And uh, we're gonna be shooting down here in this basement scene in just a minute. Dang it, you caught me. <laughs> That was the uh, Jaws eye view there. Okay, so we're on set again. You can see it all back here behind me. I'm getting ready to roll on uh, another angle here, another shot. So uh, stay tuned, it should be interesting. Okay, everybody, welcome back. Camera one, that's my old camera. Camera two, that's my new camera. Gonna show these shots side by side so you guys can see the transition between cameras. So it's a wrap today. It's February 1st, 2014. A wrap on this location, the abandoned church, it's for sale. Uh, now we're gonna pack up some gear and we're all gonna head to lunch. And then we're gonna go to the wool warehouse to shoot the final scene of the film, which is where my homeless character guy may make another appearance. Uh, I assume that they're going to shoot it with and without my part, just so they have the option. But stay tuned and I'll show you guys as much as I can. Uh, like I said, we're off to lunch now and then heading to the other location. So, <sighs> the emotion hasn't really hit me much yet about it being wrap day. You know, it's just, it's here, we're done, 24 days of shooting this month and uh, only two days off during that time, but it was awesome. I have to thank Brian Turry and Matt Peterson for this awesome, great experience. And uh, like I said, stay tuned because we're moving locations right after lunch. So here we go. Okay, so that's a wrap on this location for this movie, Abe Makes a Movie, the abandoned church over here at 1215 Hazeldine. 
northeast Albuquerque. Yeah, now we're gonna go to lunch. I'll show you guys the second location here in a minute. Uh, interesting thing about this church back here though is I'm coming back here Monday to shoot another movie and we're just gonna use different locations inside the church than what was used on this movie. So kind of interesting that I'll be back here again shortly. So yeah, stay tuned, more episode coming today. Okay, so continuing with our last day on set of Abe Makes a Movie, uh, we're at our other location now and I'm dressing up to be the homeless guy with my homeless clothing. This is my dressing room also right now, so uh, it's a little bit cold out actually. It feels yeah. like winter again. Oh yeah. So stay tuned and uh, after I transform into the homeless guy again, I'll show you guys the after, so thanks. So continuing our journey on the last day, February 1st, 2014 at the wool warehouse again and I'm partially homeless up as you can see. The makeup will happen next and then when it gets a little darker we'll shoot the scene. It should be a lot of fun. So stay tuned and stay aware and stay safe. Were you there? Look people. Here's some more of the awesome people I've gotten the chance to work with over the last month. We got hair and makeup. Charlie Scripty. I used to work outside. What? You're awesome. Awesome. Oh, yeah. <laughs> awesome people here as well. Not possible. And a couple more people here that helped out on the movie quite a bit. Especially William here. <laughs> Close up, extreme. I can see inside your brain, dude. Oh, it's empty, isn't it? Yeah, there wasn't much there. <laughs> but that's okay, because we're all brainless from time to time. So yeah, we're out here outside the wool warehouse, freezing our butts off right now a little bit finding out where we can do hair and makeup and all that other fun stuff and find out if we can get this gate open back here so it doesn't look like the place is locked. Ah, the extremes of making a movie and the fun and the moments. So, stick tuned. Pop, it's a lot Pop, people. Okay, so that's the transformation there, as you can see, from regular non-homeless guy to normal homeless looking guy. Right there. <laughs> okay, so we're still working on shooting the ending of the movie here and uh, played the homeless guy again, so that was a lot of fun. And uh, behind me here you can see everything getting set up and uh, ready to go. So stay tuned when we get wrapped, I'll let you guys know. <laughs> so instead of like happy, kind of like flattered, or, yeah, a little. Like how you, like you played it. Well, I played like, it all like. But I think just uh, like tone that down just a touch, but the little bit like, why are you more Okay, so I shot my extended part there at the end, and uh, we're getting very close to picture wrap. A couple more shots left, and we're going to be all done. It's kind of sad, actually, but that's the reality of working. You always work when there's work. You're looking way over your shoulder. Okay. Okay, this next shot is what they call in the movie industry the martini shot, which usually means last shot of the day. So uh, let's watch and see what happens, shall we? Dave, start her up. And action! Cutting? Cutting! <laughs> no, it's okay. He took off too quick. Yeah. <laughs> we don't need to make that light. This looks good. <laughs> no, I think we got it. Alright, guys, listen up! Here, call it when Matt gets back. Yeah. Never mind! <laughs> Five more minutes! <laughs> I lied, we got one more, hold on. Premature. All right, guys. That is a uh, wrap on Eight Makes a Movie, guys. Here's to another one, David. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be Thanks, you too. Thanks, Albert.
bitch. Absolutely awesome to be part of the team. There's too many hugs to film. <laughs> Awesome, man. Good job, everybody. And uh, we could do one real quick. I don't know how how well it's going to translate. Yeah, let's do it. Tell everybody to change my name. We just need to be in the light here. Hey, guys, go. We're going to take a picture. All right, so there you go, folks. Pitcher wrap on Abe Makes a Movie. It was a great four weeks, and, uh, and the sadness will hit me later. But, uh, yeah, thanks, everybody. Awesome time. I'm going to get a picture of everybody. Okay, folks, I'm heading back down to the truck now. Back over here behind me is the wool warehouse we shot in the alleyway side road there for the final scene of the movie. It went really well. Uh, and after uh, 27 days in a row, well, we, we had a couple days off in those 27 days, the movie is finally wrapped, done, over with, finished, except for possibilities of reshoots and ADR later. But uh, hopefully none of that will happen. So. Uh, all day long I've just been smiling, having a great time, and uh, now that it's over with, the emotion is hitting me, and I'm, I'm a little bit sad that it's over, but I'll still work with all these people and be part of their lives, and uh, that's about it. I guess that just about sums up my entire experience. Awesome, incredible, fun, educational, exhilarating, and exhausting. So. Once again, guys, thanks a lot. Here's Big Red behind me, my pick-em-up truck. I'm gonna jump in there and uh, 
head to the homestead, so... Yeah. Okay. Bye for now.